shows the French naturalism that was so oppressive in romantic art style. It shows determination, perseverance, and other positive characteristics of mankind. Delacour's painting also evokes strong emotions such as bravery. The painters in the Romanticism era portraying an emotion was more important than portraying facts and information. The painting, literally leading the people, is the ideal romantic painting because it shows the beauty and emotion and nationalism from the in society. The main separation between romantic music and the music prior to the Romantic era is the amount of emotion. Romantic composers are known to express raw emotion through their music. Beethoven is, Beethoven is considered by many the father of the Romantic style of music. Beethoven's music is known for its contrasting volumes and emotional score, both important aspects of romantic music. The music that you have been listening to throughout this portion of the museum is Beethoven's Ninth Symphony, Third Movement. You hear the emotion in the soft lyrical melody contrasted with intervals of dramatic fanfare. The contrasting sounds and intense emotion of this piece are what Beethoven and romantic music are all about. Beethoven and his composition are a high point for our society because of their dense emotional value and their interesting musical contrasts. The brothers Grimm, Jacob, and Willem were writers during Romanticism. They are best known for their classic fairy tales. However, they published a wide variety of literature, including a German dictionary. Some of the best known fairy tales were originally created by the Brothers Grimm, such as Little Red Riding Hood and Rapunzel. These now cheer both Disney classics for the first introduction of the supernatural element to literature. While romantic literature still focused on emotion, it also had a supernatural element shown through the usage of wizards, witches, and royal frogs, the Grimm fairy tales. However, the Grimm brothers were not all about dwarves and woodcut. Through their German dictionary or a Deutsch word group, they reflected the spirit of nationalism by spelling out every word of their homeland's language. The Grimm brothers and their romantic literature represent a high society because of their introduction of new literary ideas such as supernatural and a strong sense of nationalism. <laughs> is a painting by Gustave Corbett. It exemplifies realism ideals by portraying the negative aspects of society the way they really are. Unlike Romanticism, realistic artists did not look for the beauty of society, but instead looked at society, tragedy, and all. The Wounded Man shows the negative aspects of industrialization and the way that they ruined the common worker. Through his painting, Corbett takes a cynical look at society that was so important for realism artists. Gustave Courbet and his painting reflect a low point in society because of their raw representation of human suffering. The stormy sea portrayed how society changed through the dark colors. The artist's painting during the realism period painted everyday life in its purest form and rejected the idealistic and embellished art from the past. Artists during the realism period used many details in their artwork to stay true to the subject of the painting. 
In the past, paintings of the sea would have been portrayed as calm and include much lighter colors. However, The Stormy Sea by Winslow Homer portrays how it is not ideal to have a perfect and calm sea. In return, Winslow Homer and other realistic painters are trying to say that life is not always calm and beautiful like the idealistic paintings of the past, but instead more like the painting during the realism period. Realism exhibited the darker aspects of this time period. Dickens portrays the changes in society through his A Tale of Two Cities. During the period of realism, writers would describe the actual living conditions and injustice in the social classes and government. Dickens portrayed the miserable lives of people and how desperate they were for everyday necessities such as food, clothing, and shelter. The writing of Dickens also depicted the social injustices in the government and in the living conditions of the people. He criticized these things through the descriptions in his book. In the past, writing would portray the goodness in society and show an ideal civilization with no social injustice and everybody's life would be content. Impressionism period was similar to the previous realism period, however, it focused more on different aspects of life. Many painters during the Impressionism, including Monet, would paint en plein air, which was French for in open air. They would paint outdoors to capture the lighting and essence of landscapes, such as the park in this particular painting. Impressionism art consisted of landscapes and everyday life, such as ballet or chores around the house. Impressionism captured the first impression of a scene or subject where realism captured the true essence and reality of a subject or scene. Morning in the Garden at Volcres Zone by Edouard Voyard portrayed the changes from realism to impressionism through the different artistic techniques exemplified in the paintings. The techniques of impressionism focused more on lighting and tried to capture the first impression of a subject or landscape, where in realism the artist would try to convey a message about reality through his painting. The different lighting of the garden in this painting is shown through the shadows and the way the light hits the grass, butterflies, and flowers. It captures the first impression of a peaceful and beautiful garden and is painted with lighter and more joyous colors. Impressionism composers and musicians such as Claude Debussy successfully transferred the emotions of a given moment into their music. Debussy's best known work is his piano piece, Claire de Lune, the piece you have been listening to. The relaxed tempo and simplicity of this piece paint a picture in the listener's mind of a certain moment or scene. In Impressionist music, each change in tempo or intensity represents a different emotion and disruption or change to the moment. Debussy is considered an extremely successful musician during the Impressionism period because his compositions create a certain emotion in their listener and paint a picture of a specific scene. <laughs> 